Hi and welcome to a video using EFT to release feeling stuck. It's a really simple technique. It combines tapping on the acupuncture points with some basic talk therapy. You don't need to think, you just need to copy, you just need to tap along with me. And if you feel a bit silly, don't worry. Or it seems a bit odd, don't worry. But what you will feel at the end of it is an instant relief. You don't need to think, thing, you just need to copy and tap along with me. Just to quickly show you where the tapping points that you're going to be working on are the karate chop, between your eyes here, on the bone of your eyes, the bone under your eyes, the dip between your lip, your chin, along your collarbone, under your arms, and just on the top of your head. So you might feel silly, you might think that's really daft, but just do it. It's really simple, but it really works. So stay with me. So you're just going to come to this point, and again, just tapping gently, not hitting, and just repeating everything that I say. So even though I feel so stuck. I can't make the changes that I need to. I deeply and completely love and respect all of you. Even though I keep going through the same cycles. I keep making the same mistakes. I feel so stuck. I deeply and completely love and respect all of me. Even though life isn't flowing for me. I feel stagnant. I want to change, but I can't. I deeply and completely love and respect all of me. Now you're just going to take a deep breath in and breathe out slowly. Then just carrying on tapping and copying along with me between the eyes. I feel so stuck. Nothing seems to change. I'm just so stagnant. My life's stuck in a negative loop. I can't let go of all this pain. I can't let go of my negative patterns. Feels like I'll never change. Life just feels so stuck. I can't let go. Everyone says just let go. And I can't, I'm just stuck. I'm stagnant. And nothing's flowing. And just very gently, you're just gonna tap along your chest, your breastbone along here. Deep breath in. And breathing out slowly. Give your hands a little shiggle. Then you're going to come back to this crouching point here. So even though nothing changes, the cycles go on and I feel so frustrated with myself. I deeply and completely love and respect all of me. even though I can't let go and flow. It's too hard. I'm so annoyed at myself. I deeply and completely love and respect all of me. Even though Nothing's flowing my way. It's also stagnant. And I can't control it. I deeply and completely love and respect all of me. So coming to the tapping point here again. I'm just so stuck. 
Everything's so stagnant. I can't change. My life never changes. Nothing's going my way. Nothing's flowing. I feel so stagnant. And I've no control over it. I can't just let go. It feels too hard. When I look back, so much has changed. When I look back, I do let go, even if it takes a long time. I'm not stuck as I think. Things aren't as stagnant as I think. I can change things. I can change how I feel. All this irritation, that feeling stuck, I softly let it go. I lovingly let it go. It's safe to let it go. I allow changes in my life. I allow my life to change and expand. Things can start to flow. It's safe for things to change. It's safe for things to flow. I am safe. You give yourself a little tap there. And a deep breath in. And slowly out. Hopefully you're feeling a little calmer, a little less stuck. EFT works on a very specific level. So when we're doing EFT like that, it's very, very general. If you want to go deeper or work more independently, you can do that on your own, looking at other videos, or you can come over to me at Sky Rose Wellbeing and we can organise one-on-one -on -one sessions. Or you can just keep on practising it, adding your own words in and slowly allowing your emotions to calm down, release, and let everything just flow. I hope you found that useful. Please like and subscribe. EFT can help to support all kinds of negative emotions and negative patterns that you're in. I run a series of online groups weekly and monthly. There is a weekly tapping group, which is on a Monday, which is for just getting rid of the worries that you've got about the week. A coffee and tap on Friday during the day, which is for releasing the upsets you've had during the week. I run happy tappy time for little children, for just the worries they've got, like fear of the dark and things like that. And one for teenagers with angst to help support them with all of their life struggles that they're going through. Once a month I also run an evening session which goes more deeper, goes into the belly of the beast, looks at more of the darker emotions that are going on in our life just now. So if you're interested in any of those groups, come over to Sky Rose Wellbeing on Facebook and book a place. Or if you'd like a more personal experience, you can book a one-on-one -on -one with me where we can go more in depth into what your actual issues are and what your problems are to help support you move forward in your life. Hope to see you there.